Hey everybody, Bobby G here along with the lovely Mrs. G. Hi. How are you, Mrs. G? Hungry. Are you hungry? I am. Mrs. G is always hungry. Believe it or not, looking at her, she is always hungry. It's true. So tonight or today, this afternoon, this evening, whatever, um, we are outside of the Laughlin River Lodge. Uh, we are going to go to the Bighorn Cafe and try their prime rib. So we're going to do another Laughlin prime rib review. Um, mm -hmm. Yay! We have not eaten here before. I have not been to this restaurant, so uh, we're we're going in here and uh, gonna give it a shot. We heard it's good. We'll find out. We will bring you with us, right? Oh yes. Okay. You and always come along with yes, us. Yes, please come along. And uh, afterwards, we'll give you our thoughts. But uh, one other thing, guys, you know, we're having a blast doing these videos. Are you having fun? Oh so much fun good me too so and if you're if you're liking the videos guys i would really appreciate it if you like and subscribe to the channel hit that little bell button that'll notify you when we put another video up we have plenty more in the works more in laughlin and maybe a few in bullhead city we'll see what kind of surprises happen so all right guys we will talk to you in a little while bye all right guys we are outside of the laughlin river lodge we are walking in going to uh See how the prime rib is. All righty, guys. We are walking into the Laughlin River Lodge. Thank you. There goes Mrs. G. And uh, I believe the Bighorn Cafe is downstairs, so that's where we're going to head. We'll work our way through the casino and find the restaurant. We are working our way towards the downstairs escalator to the Bighorn Cafe. A little bit busy in here today. A little busy in here, Mrs. G? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, having to mask up right now as per policy in Nevada. Clark County, I should say. So, okay, second floor Bighorn Cafe. That's where we are headed. Down the escalator we go. There's a nice view of the river up there. Oh, Colorado River. Gorgeous. It is beautiful out there today. Alright, down the escalator we go. That is where the buffet used to be that has not been open for a couple years now. And straight ahead would be the Bighorn Cafe. All right, we're walking into the Bighorn Cafe. Nice view of the river. Nice chandeliers. Cool looking bar. Nice stonework. Very nice. Oh. That will work. That will work wonderfully. Thank you so much. All right. Okay, so it's about 4.30 on a Sunday and we are inside the Bighorn Cafe, which is very nice. There is Mrs. G. Hi, Mrs. G. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Yeah. yeah, it looks very nice in here. It does. Very, Gorgeous. very nice ambulance, right? Ambience. <laughs> nice view of the river over here. So, um, so far things are looking good. I'm going to scan the menu real quick. I know we've got some lighting issues going on there, but... Uh, we have breakfast, healthy choices, omelets, so more breakfast choices, classics, steak and eggs. They look like they have a really nice breakfast selection here. Big horn bites, which are sort of appetizers, but a lot of that stuff looks like it could be a meal. Soups and sandwiches, salads, a big selection of Burgers, very large menu actually. And then on the back, char broiled, prime rib. That's what we're here for. That's what we will try. Chef specialties. And we both are gonna be doing the 12 ounce cut of prime rib, which is $28. Um, and we will see how it goes. I'm a little excited to try it. The uh, food looks as nice as the restaurant. We should be pleased, I would think. Late. All right, so we're here at the Bighorn Cafe. We're both having iced tea. Miss Tracy is jamming to the Beatles. 
or not the Beatles, the Bee Gees, huh? Say, the Beatles. <laughs> the Beatles. The Bee Gees, which are playing, and she's just grooving right along. Food has been ordered. We both got prime ribs with baked potato and salads. So we'll see how it is. All right, so we just got our salads delivered. It's just a basic garden salad. I got blue cheese with mine. Looks very nice. Tracy. Hi, Tracy. Hi. Got ranch on hers. Looks very good. Give it a shot. All right. Let's see how the salad is. Nice and fresh. Very salady. Yes. <laughs> really good ranch. Really good what? Ranch. Oh, the ranch. Nice. Yeah. Really good. All right. Well, time to dig in. We'll be back. Okay, so our prime rib just showed up, and by first appearance, it looks amazing. Amazing. Looks delicious. That's Tracy's prime rib, baked potato, nice assortment of steamed vegetables. Comes with um, ketchup, sour cream, and chives, and creamy horseradish. Some bread. There's mine. Everything looks uh, pretty darn good, and we're getting ready to try it. I have to say, Deborah, our server, has been. Uh, Lovely. Lovely. Yeah, she's been doing an excellent job. All right, so we got our prime rib here. It looks delicious. We are getting ready to uh, to try it. You go ahead. You go first, Mrs. G. Potato looks good. I the skin. Okay. Tell me what you think. I'm going to start getting this potato ready to get doctored up. <laughs> Is it good? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Well, nice. So it looks good. It looks like it's cooked very well. Let's see. It is. Garlic. I feel like it's garlic. Ah, okay. So I'm just going to try a piece straight before I dip it into anything. Mm. And I'm talking about mouth, though. Um, very tender, very tasty. I, I'm liking this. I'm going to try to put the uh, crust here with the, the seasoning on it. You said it was garlicky? Yes. Which we love garlic. We love garlic. Mm. Okay. You get jittery. Yeah, it's really good. Mm -hmm. That is very, very good. It is. Very I apologize, don't mean to talk about my mouth full, but got a little excited. This is uh, this is very tasty. So far, very happy, pleasantly surprised. And before we totally demolish these, one more quick view. Got the potato all loaded up. She's pretty much demolished her vegetables already. I like veggies. I'm, I'm busy talking. I haven't eaten too much yet, but uh be digging in here shortly. All right, guys, we'll see you in a little bit. Okay, so we just got our bill from the Bighorn Cafe. Our iced teas were $2 each, and our prime rib, which was the 12 ounce cut, the larger of the two cuts they offer, 28 each. Total with tax, 6503. Obviously, we will tip our servers quite well. We always always like to recommend tip your servers, bartenders, cocktail waitresses, valets, and uh, lift drivers. And lift drivers, yes, tip your lift drivers too. <laughs> but take care of your servers when they take care of you. These people are busting their ass to usually short staff to. Uh, to make you feel good so anyway uh that's our bill hey guys so we just got done eating at the bighorn cafe um we just snuck around the corner here there's no one over here so we pulled the old mask off real quick just to do a review while we're still inside um what do you think tracy i think it was excellent yeah yep what'd you like tell, um, tell me what your, your thoughts are i think their salad was amazing their ranch dressing i i want mm -hmm. um it was fresh and the tomatoes were just delicious the way they popped in your mouth yeah. the prime rib was excellent the vegetables were okay the potato was large and delicious so you liked everything i did okay yeah i thought everything was was actually really good first time eating here um one thing when i when i look 
on their website. It, it shows that this place is 24 hours and it shows like a steak and egg special late at night, that kind of thing. Um, after checking with the server, um, Deborah, who actually did a really good job, uh, kudos to Deborah and then her bus person, um, Haley, they both did a great job. But, um, and Timothy. And Timothy, yeah, they, all, they were all good. Everybody was friendly. Um, but they're open from eight to eight right now. So just 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. And then on Saturdays and Fridays, they're open till 10. So eight, eight, eight to eight during the week, eight to 10 Fridays and Saturdays. Um, however, they do serve the full menu all day. So you can get breakfast all day long, um, that kind of thing. Their, their menu was quite extensive. I thought it looked really good um, from the way that dinner was tonight. I would mm -hmm. love to come back here and try their breakfast out. Yeah. Like, even a burger or something yep. but um my thoughts on dinner i thought the prime rib was excellent it had very good flavor on the, the crust on the outside um garlicky which i really liked um the salad was delicious the blue cheese dressing was was really good baked potato i thought it was tasty tracy said she thought her baked potato was just slightly undercooked a little a little firmer than than she likes and she's probably Sorry. right you know it was good but yeah probably could have been cooked a little more that would probably be about my only only complaint which is That's very it. minor yeah. so right now i would say this to me this rates number two out of all the places we've tried for the prime rib yep. so it would be daniel's first yep. right and then the Bighorn Cafe, mm -hmm. Regency now moves into third place, yep. right? And then Stockman's. Stockman's over at the Edgewater. And last, that just sort of holding firm down there would be the Prime Rib Room, unfortunately. And maybe, uh, you know, I heard they're serving at the table again. So, and, maybe and carving, we'll it maybe we'll have to give it another shot down the road here. But we still have a few more to do and uh, a few more Prime Ribs in Laughlin to do. Yes. Uh, probably gonna throw in a few uh, little bullhead city here surprises now and then but um i would definitely have to say hit, hit the, the g, g spot, spot. Woo! Woo! so anyway um we will see you on the next one guys thanks for watching bye bye hey we're back for one other thing if you guys are enjoying the content please like and subscribe to the channel hit that little bell that'll notify you when we throw out another video we would love it would you love it i would love it would yes. make me smile all right do it for miss g if you don't want to do it for me thanks guys bye